Cape Cod Pantoum. Tonight, you're loaning Billy your car, a brand new seal gray Volkswagen Passat with four doors. Though last week at 3 a.m., he stole your canoe and sank it in the autumn sea, then swam ashore. Tonight, you're lending Bill your car, it's brand new, and he's a well-meaning, blue-eyed, Byronic drinking man, who last week at 3 a.m. stole your beach canoe, and when it sank, he blamed it on a dolphin. A well-meaning, blue-eyed, Byronic, hard-drinking man, whose phone calls you take, no matter the hour, who sunk your canoe and blamed it on a dolphin, and the young man with him, whom the sea sadly devoured. So you'll always take Billy's call, no matter the hour. Besides, you sigh, his mother's dying, and he's drinking again. He's no longer a young man, he's sad, and he's drowning. And neither are you, and all friends sometimes sin. Besides, you sigh, his mother's dying too, that's why he's drinking. She wasn't a beauty, she came on to you long ago. And he's not a young man, he's drunk and he's drowning. So you press the phone to your cheek, stare out the dark window. Who hasn't come on to you? Who wasn't lovely long ago? Even Billy did his tragic need, his blank blue eyes. You press the phone to cheek, stare out the dark window, and listen to him make a mess of our peaceful lives. Now back in bed, we return to our disrupted romance. Although last week at 3 a.m. he stole your canoe, you set a sinking man adrift in the sea of second chance. Tonight, you've loaned Billy your car again, brand new. <laughs>